there's several things that can happen if somebody is is hit um, in the jaw or, or, or face around the teeth. Um, sometimes the teeth can be knocked out. And if a tooth is knocked out, it's best to get to the dentist as soon as possible and place the tooth in preferably milk and if milk's not available, water. Also, some, some pharmacies will have uh, what's called ringer solution. Um, that is probably pretty hard to find, but if you can find it, it's better than milk. But the time is such a factor, you're probably best off getting to the dentist as quickly as possible. If a tooth gets hit, sometimes the tooth can fracture. And this fracture can be um, where it doesn't involve the root of the tooth or it can be all the way to the point where it does involve the root of the tooth. And you can tell that if the tooth is bleeding from the inside, that usually will require a root canal. And it's best to see a dentist as soon as possible. I personally have had that happen to me when I was hit by a car. And that's what got me interested in dentistry, was a bunch of my front teeth were broken off, uh, a little bit above the gum line, and they were bleeding. And uh, the root canals were done, and those teeth are still in my mouth today. Another outcome of trauma to the jaw could be a fractured jaw or um, a bruise to the jaw joint. And this, this can show up as the teeth fitting together in a different way than they did before. If you or someone you know has uh, trauma to the teeth or jaw, it's important to see a dentist, preferably me. This is Dr. Aaron Johnson, helping you feel better about your smile, and don't forget to floss.